My name is Honorable Lion Batife Daisi, uh, an indigen of Ekpe local government from Ajaganobe quarters, Borokini family, and um, the, from Ibejuleki, the Oshifila family. I'm born and brought up in Kurudu, Majidu to be precise, and I schooled at uh, Sianos Primary School. Ogijo Community High School, Shagamu, and Lagos State Public where I obtained my ND and National, higher National Diploma. And today, I'm a representative of the people, the representing the good people of Majidu at the Kurudu West Legislative Council. Thank you. Honorable Lion Batifer is a son of a great philanthrop a philanthropist called Kola Wale Batifer. He was born and brought up in Ekpe Division and was raised by a mother and a loving father. <laughs> and God gave him the grace to uh, give out to many of us and someone like me who emanate from his, um, his strength. And today I'm trying to keep alive what he has left behind because he, 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 he tra started this habit of giving to people irrespective. We believe that giving to people is a way of living. So, on a Batifer that I see, is a son of Batifer, is a philanthropy, is a humanitarian, and is also a founder of an organization that is reaching out to the people at the local level, at that doorstep, which is known as Omitito Ambassador. This is the medium I use to reach out to people. I'm the CEO of Omitito Ambassador Group of Nigeria, Ikurudu. When my father died in 1991, when I was still in CLS Primary School, my mother faced a lot as a widow, and there was no way she could raise us. She has five of us, and I have to resort into fish farming and uh, um, uh, local dredging. That was how I trained myself from primary school to secondary school. And to the glory of God, as I proceeded to Lagos State Polytechnic, after my graduation from HND, I served at uh, I did my NYC at Yobe State. I was redeployed back to Ikorodu due to security issues. And God granted my request by someone called Sinclair Oko, the director of Simoku Nigeria Limited, who employed me to work with him at a dredging company. And when I discover that many people are still going through what I went through while I was free young. I decided that from the stipend I received as a salary, I will reach out to people. So I started my humanitarian service by giving back to the society through paying WAEG for people, purchasing junk from every year. This has started since in, in 2017. Buying junk from WAEG from GC for people who particularly are fatherless that their mother could not be able to raise them. So these are what I've been doing until 2021 when the people rose up and said, Batife, you need to represent us. You are a good son of Majidu. We need you at the ends of affairs. And I contested as a counselor. Today I'm a counselor because the people stood. They stood by their word. They said I should contest and I won. Till today, I'm still representing them. The, you can, for verification, you can go at Omitutu underscore ambassador at Instagram, Twitter, on Facebook, Omitutu, or Honorable Batifer. Um, even on Google, you can Google Honorable Batifer that you see. You will see more of our philanthropic and humanitarian job. So I decided to take up a leadership position because I know the impact it will make to put a smile and hope in the hope of the less privileged. And for record purpose, Oba Ayagore spelling B. Since we have been doing it, Majidu as a community have never participated. Last year, I sponsored 30 children to Oba Ayangbona spelling B. Majidu came second, Majidu came third for the first time in the history. And to the glory of God, these children I'm talking about have not been admission into secondary school. We've done our part to support them. And I'm begging the entire world, I'm begging the entire Majidu, I'm going to the Kurudu division. Let's look inward for children that do not have the capacity to train themselves in the education sector. Please, let's do more to bring smile to them. Thank you. 
Yes, I've been elected for over three years. The people can speak. I've been for borehole. I've facilitated one. I have given 27 electric pool. I have given more than 566 jump from. I've given 34 GC and WIAC. I've given market women what we call market help, which is a sum of 13,000 naira. We've done a whole lot of things. I built the uh, food cafeteria for the CMS primary school. My hammer, uh, my hammer matter where I graduated as a secondary school school living uh, student. Also, presently at the Terrino community, I'm doing a three bedroom mini air center, mobile air center. Build is under construction now. Also, at the LG primary school, we want to give them a food cafeteria. But presently, the toilet, the suck away in LG primary school is being evacuated by my organization and myself. We've done a whole lot of things that I cannot mention. I've mentioned the social media where a uh, social media and where you can verify some of this project we have done. So the people should still look forward to I'm contesting to still become a councillor come second time. Well we still have some projects on the like um Majidun Grammar School. If you go there there is no place for the children to the place they are eating is not hygienic. Um it's part of my plan to give them a befitting uh, cafeteria at Majidun Grammar School. Also, Iduroko at uh, Link Road. I want to appreciate these names, Honorable Robert Jimmy Benson and the good doing Senator, Senator Aguru Tokumbo. My letters are on their table and they promise that they are going to facilitate that road, they are going to construct it, they are going to bring it to another because Iduroko Link Majidu um, 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 uh, is a link road from Iduroko to Agrit that can serve as a diversion to soften traffic. These are many um, projects we are still looking at. And also, it told the primary school is dilapidated when it comes to rain season, all the children are out of school. I have sent to Super, I have sent a letter to um, uh, Senator Tokumabudu, as I have also discussed with my leader, on the Baba Jimmy Benson, for us to look at the Toyobu primary school so that they can help us to bring it to a modern standard. The children can not be denied of learning when it comes to rainy season. Also, I want to thank Dr. Saeed Dibikuni for helping and supporting us when we seek for government, Lagos state government led by Baba, um, Baba Jide Sonolu, the current governor of Lagos State, to look into CRS primary school dilapidated situation. And I thank God, the government swift into action to the support and Dr. Saeed Ibikuni supporting us, helping us to fast forward it. Today, that place is renovated for the children to use. So I'm telling the entire Majidu indigent that there are more projects for us to be done. Um, Iwabu still need a link road and gutter um, I'm not there, there. still in lighting to discourage uh, Uglums and Williams. In the local to that going to include, I'm promising you by the grace of God, the good, the good, good senator is hearing me now, and also our light, open me at the bar, he could do. The Baba Jimmy Benson is also listening to me. They all know Baba Jimmy have been there, the senator too have been there. I'm very sure, very soon they will put that road. In order, also a way now we should the street. We need lighting. We need water. These are all the things I'm still going to work on to make sure that the people have benefit of democracy. I'm very sure that vote for me for a second time will bring more liberation to our area.